All right, guys, let's work on our Scotty tail. A couple things is that you hope that your tail is truly only seven inches long. A lot of them do seem to be a little bit longer. So the first thing I like to do, find the tip of that tail and cut it off right just above the tip. So I'm holding my nail over the tip and snip. That's going to get as short as possible and hopefully make it look like it's about seven inches. Now, from the side, some things you got to worry about is like we had talked about before. He's got his top line is questionable and he's got a dip in front of his tail. So, um, and also his tail sets low. It should be in the center of my fingers and it's not. It's more to the back side. So we're going to leave the front side longer. Try and make it look like an upside down carrot. But one thing they do say is they should never look like a flag. They do not. And I believe that's stated in their breed standard. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stack that tail up. And I know that I want to take more hair off the back. So I'm going to go ahead and hit this with my scissors first. And try and create a little bit of a point at the tip. And I'm not going to do much to the front side at this point. I'm going to take my blending shears and come in tight. And it's his tail sets so low that he's a little uncomfortable with me holding it. So I'm just trying to be really gentle because you don't, you know, he's a sweet Scotty, but you don't want to tick these Scotties off because they got mouth and bite power similar to a German Shepherd. So and uh, just FYI, German Shepherds, I believe, are second as far as crushing power. So let's just make them happy as we're working. But see how we're cleaning that all up? This is nice and tight. I've seen people come as short as a 7F blade on the back side of this tail. And I'm pretty close to it, but I'm just looking for a little natu more natural blend. Now, once I get that done, I'm going to pull this. Um, I'm going to pull the front coat back and then come in here and angle and blend that in from the side, not the front. Same thing on the other side. We're going to come over here. Let's see if you can get a better view. Get over here. Ah, ah, ah. It's okay, Baba. Nope. Nope. Stand. Comb all this over. Stop. And blend as well. Okay, and then the front we're not going to do a lot with. If you need to, you can run a stripping knife over it, but the blending happened here. So this is what's going to give you your tail set and also the fill to correct your tail set. So you trimmed it more from the side than the top. And that's it. We've done some correcting to our little guy's tail set. Thanks.